Hey guys, what's up? Um, today I'm just be doing an overview of all the clothes I have with me right now. Yeah. I know I'm just gonna start it off with this the Gamer XT Trainers G95 XT 9 half inches, all black with gray split welding. Nice little trainer. Pretty dope with the red palm pad. It makes it look like it has red lining. Um, after that, I'm gonna go with the Rollins from Berlin Cap Store 17 ICBR. Blue Seattle and I see C I No, I see the yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Um camel and Blue Seattle colorway. It's got a lot of wear. I thought you grabbed the camel, camel one. Um it does have baby blue eyes and I release it to that, but I should be putting it back to camel. This looks really bad. Um so yeah, you use a lock on the coach I trade for it, so yeah. Um really nice glove. Next, I'll go with my least favorite glow by a long shot, my Laser Pro, 11 and a half inches, baby blue and gray, or Columbia blue, with my name in it, um, looks great, but just love it isn't up to par with long gloves, um, deep pocket, I did do the hot water treatment, that helped it out a lot, but, not a very good glove. I do not recommend them. Spend your money on a freaking 44. Um, next, we have my Wilson HUK Governor Monk December 2015 Retro Tan and Red Colorway 1786, 11 and a half inches. Great glove. Uh, I love it. Uh, might trade on. Definitely considering not doing it now. Because after thinking about it, it is a really high quality glove. Really nice. I love using it. So, I mean, I don't know why I traded. I've already spent enough money. Shit, no. But yeah, it looks great. Feels great. Life's great. <sighs> Next, I have my Wilson 2K 1788. Um, This is a 2K 11. Uh, one fourth inches plays like 11. Um, super skin with walnut and camel and black. That's the colorway. Um, lace is pretty decent. I mean, it's okay. This glove was released to that softball fans lace, which is really soft, kind of thin, but it's good lace. This is really good glove though, high quality. Um, lining is okay, I guess. I've got enough parts to be honest. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But yeah, I really like it. Great glove. Feels great. Still stiff. And yeah. Next, I got my Wilson 1788 Glove of the Month, September 2014. My birthday Glove of the Month. I didn't get it for my birthday. It's just pretty dope. 11 and 4 inches. This one does play a little bit bigger than. The other one, so I'll say quite a little for a little bit of adhesive stain, but new with tags. Um, considering taking out the tags, considering trading it. <coughs> trading it with me. Yeah, but I don't know. I really Wait, like it. Or should we tell them what the trade would be? No. Why not? It'd be for the Donaldson. I don't think I'll do it, but I'm considering it. But yeah. I really like that glove. The gun metal really pops. Um, next, I'll grab my Rollins Harbor Hide Pro Department RTV, whatever you want to call it. I'm pretty sure we went over in my last video. We took out the heel pad in one of our gloves, but I'm not sure. Uh, Oxblood and black colorway with black mesh. Um, Pro 200 2 PM Pro. The Pro at the end stands for the RGD, 11 and a half inches for a professional player, like all I want to say. Great glove, nice field. Um, your tan lining feels great, like a modern guitar. I'm just breaking it a little bit, man. I can almost swallow a ball already, but it's a pretty deep pattern, I'd say. Um, I would rather have an MP, but this is a really nice glove. And I like, you know, plan on using it quite a bit, so yeah. Um, I'm definitely more of a fan of Kip Lover. Uh, like so, why don't you trade my Donaldson with Kip Lover? <laughs> um, Pro Preferred, because yeah. you like Rollins. Oh, wait. Jaden. You like Rollins more, right? Yep. 
And you like Kip Baltimore, right? Yep. So you're getting a Rawlings Kip for a Wilson Steer Hide. Anyway. Um, it lines up, Jaden. Next is a Wilson AGK, another Grover of the Month, December. Oh, this is a 2014 Glove of the Month. Uh, you definitely can see the adhesive. And you flash really brings out all the flaws in gloves. So yeah, there's like in this you can in the flash, it's really bad discoloration in in the back of the fingers. Totally it looks off. it looks like it's saddle tan. Yeah. He did switch to two and pinky. Uh, it's definitely a lot nicer. The finger laces are starting to curl and all that jazz. And it feels amazing. It's a great glow. <laughs> yeah, and I probably wouldn't use this. It is 11.75. The DD15 is supposed to be like the OG. But um, it definitely plays pretty big. So I probably wouldn't use it as shortstop. But I mean, I'm sure someone who's a little bit taller could. I'm not very tall. Um, I haven't gone over this. I have plus 17 ICC. Plus 17, yeah, ICC. I forgot for a second. All camel with red stitching and brown stitching. Red for right here. And the rest is brown. Uh, I did take off half the heel pad. I don't like it. But, you know what? I'll survive. It's pretty nice. Actually, hey, at least you got the video, though. The ball stays in the pocket a lot better with the tightened up fingers, as you guys can see. So yeah, I plan on using it more, seeing if I still do like the heel pad, maybe it will be a little bit nicer, I don't know. Hopefully. And yeah. Great glove. Link dips play 11 and a half. Now 11.75, probably one of the better infield patterns for short stuff. Um, and third base, that'll be a good combo. And my last, but definitely not least, um, my first ever high quality glove. My Rollins Prefer Pro S12 ICBR. This is my gamer. Like, second season with it. Oh, I use this quite a bit. Oh, it's for some reason, it won't get floppy. No matter how I treat it, um, it's got the nice form. It's definitely an awkward form for most people. Oh my god, I forgot the mocha. Oh. Um, here, I'll get that out you oh, yeah. talk a little bit. Um, anyways, it's definitely got a weird form. Really flat fingers with really flat fingers. This pinky's really pushed out. 11 and 1 inches. Plays 11 and a half. But yeah, I really love it. It's just a great glove, high quality. Um, but yeah. Bruce, yeah, I don't care what color way I like the other one. And this is actually my last glove right here. My soon to be gamer, my Rollins Purple for Mocha 11 1 4 plays 11. But it is really nice. I'm trying to form it exactly like my Cruciato with that awkward wide form. But that's fine. I um, really like it. All Mocha colored leather with brown lacing. Pro S88 and 11 1 4 inches, like I said. The lace here, I definitely do not notice it. Unlike this glove, you do notice it. You do not even feel like this. But I really like it. Um, it has a great feel. The Petards is amazing. Um, this is definitely the best glove I have with Petards. Um, you know what else has good Petards? Yeah, Brian. No. My Donaldson. Oh, yeah. This, um... Um, it had a good, this had good guitars, just like my old Pro Awesome place. Yeah. But yeah, guitars I think are getting better. Um, not as wrinkly, I've seen the less wrinkly ones. So. That's really it for this video, guys. Um, I hope you like this video. This is an old overview of all the clothes I had with me. Pretty soon we'll be doing a full collection video with Aaron and I. Yeah, so, would you guys like to see that get gamed or shelved? Game by me or shelf by Jaden? Shelf by Jaden. Yeah, hope you guys like this video. Come like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.